everyone, welcome back to another episode of Rest World. We have a quarter final cup game today uh, between Highgate Albion 3s and uh, NLR. Uh, they play both in the same division, uh, Division 4, I believe. I'm going to put the table here, as I always do. Uh, they've played twice before, and uh, Highgate 3s have uh, won both times. Uh, but last time we left Highgate Albion 3s, this is what happened. So yeah, uh, hopefully none of that. Hopefully just a good cup game if we draw straight to penalties. Uh, so it's going to be an interesting match. I know uh, Highgate Albion 3s are challenging for promotion and they're in the cup as well. So um, they could do the double. And uh, yeah, I'm just getting ready. I'm rushing because I was too busy watching Rafa, who's losing at the moment to Medvedev. So uh, hopefully he wins. And uh, we're playing on Astro today as well, which is great. I love Astro. Uh, you know, I don't like the grass pitches because they just cut up so much and then you basically end up playing on mud. So, uh, yeah, Astro today. Yeah, hopefully it's a good game. I haven't had problems with uh, Highgate. I've been threes before, ref them three, four times. NOR, I've never refed. So it should be interesting how they come out. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you at the game. Uh, I'll bring a different colour top because I remember last time Highgate, I've been threes, played in like a navy bluish. So, uh, yeah, I'll bring my like purple or turquoise top and then... Uh, if it's a problem, I'll change into it. But I'll wear the black one because it's long sleeve. And it's it's sunny outside, but it's cold. So, uh, yeah, we're heading out now. And uh, we'll see you at the game. I hope you enjoyed the first half. Captains! Uh, cup game, quarterfinals, big one. Uh, if we draw, we go straight for pens, okay? But we'll get there if we do draw, okay? Just quickly, how I like to referee. Uh, I don't mind speaking to players. You guys know that I've refed you before. I haven't rested you guys before, but I don't mind speaking to any of your players. So if you've got loud players, just let them know. Ref's all right, you can speak to him. I'll try to keep the game flowing. As long as you don't want to play football, I'll let the game flow. If you don't want to be silly, then you'll just get a whistle whistle until you don't start behaving yourselves, yeah? There's only so much I can do with controlling the game, cards and stuff. If it gets too much, then I'll speak to you lot. So speak to your teams, yeah. calm it down a bit, okay? Yeah. Uh, you're the away team. Yeah. Heads, tails, just call it. Heads. Exit. Side door kick. Side door kick. Have a good day. Have a good one. Oh boy! Come on! He's on. No, he's run behind you. Six. Six. He's run right behind you. One of many controversial offside calls today. I'm calling the line. As you can see, it gets played over the top here. Yeah, he definitely looks onside. Uh, the six is keeping him on. Uh, they get a lot more difficult throughout the game and he lost it over. You can't see a lot on this half because of the sun. Sorry about that. Just want to admire this touch and bang, smash it in on the volley. Oh, Here we go again. We're pulling. Go away, Reds. Just go to your half, please. Just go to your half. 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 John, that side. 
Go to your half, I'll do your place. Go to your half, I'll do your place. Go over, go over, please. Go over, please. Do me a favor, go over. I'm not over. Oh, no, no, do it after. Go over. Go over. I'll deal with it. I'll deal with it. Go over. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Just go in your half, please. Go in your half. There was a lot to see. I know what I saw. Go in your half. Right, you guys wait there. You guys. Right. I'll deal with you guys first, then I'll go over there. Right. You. Right. Uh, name, please. Right, you've come from behind, grabbed him. It's a yellow, okay? Your name, please. Corey. Seen a punch. You're off. I'll deal with their team. Just wait. I did f him! I did f him, man! Keep up. 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 Keep Hey, what was your captain's name, Dory? Bro, cancel the game, you can't get free. Uh, listen, man. listen, I've just, given the yellow two reds. Yeah. Have you set the keeper? Yeah, have you set the keeper? Yeah. 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 You set the keeper? Yeah. 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 Well, they're keepers, they're not there. Yeah, yeah. yeah keeper's yeah, yeah. gone as well. There's two reds and one for us. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Ten. For me? Yeah. Name. Yeah, yeah. 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 Red? Yes, man. Oh, Multiple times. Oh, I sent their captain off for the same thing as well. What, what's what's good? Multiple times. Just like their captain. Keep going, keep going. I had hold of him, right? So he won't go nowhere near no one. He kept going. There was one push with him. And then their captain kept going as well. Okay? What are we calling two reds and a yellow, yeah? Huh? Two reds each and a yellow for the centre back. Okay. 9v9. What a load of uh, over something so stupid so let's break down the two red cards and the yellow so let's start with the yellow this is a center back running up and uh, just drags the number 10 on the floor so he got the yellow card and this is the red card so you see the 23 yeah throws a punch maybe throws another one and that's why he got red carded this is the keeper's red card and he's oh my god he's just jumped and punched him in the back of his head he said he grabbed him but pff, that's that's two red cards so now we move over to the NLR captain, here we go, uh, gets a number 10 in a headlock, he's actually got two incidences, so there's a well, half a headlock, and here he is again with the 23, he gets punch, and he looks like he swings a punch, he said he didn't, but his arm definitely swings, so uh, I think that is a deserved red card for the captain of NLR, uh, let me know how you think we're doing so far in uh, these incidents, it looked like he was in a headlock as well on the floor, this is crazy. And the last red card, probably the softest as well, uh, there's the foul, nothing in it, there's the push, and this is where it all started, so definitely a yellow for starting it, and I did say to him, because he kept going back in and back in, and then even after this, when they ran over to the sides again, he was involved, so the softest red card, definitely out of the four, but the last red card, so that's four people sent off, and one yellow. If you go, the game's off. If you go, the game is off. If you not go in, the game is off. If you not go in, the game is off. If you not go in, the game is off. Both of you, both of you. If you not go in, the game is off. If you not go in, the game is off. I want to see how the game plays out. If it's getting silly, then I'm going to call it. I'm going to tell you now, I think it's all. We are one after that. Try and keep it a bit more of a better game of karma. You want to bring on two subs either side and it should be 11-11. Nah, and man. just them players can't come on. Nah, man. No, No? No, because it's, then it's alright to throw away punches, man. It's no, not I get what you're if saying. If it was friendly, yeah. You know the, if, not, not, if it was a friendly, yeah. Huh? If it was a friendly, yeah, but nah, man. Let's keep playing the game. Huh? Yeah. So that was the manager asking me if they can just do two subs instead of two red cards. Uh, no chance, man. Especially after that first go. Friendly, yes, but in this situation, no, because that just means people can get away with whatever they want in this game. Let's go! So after an absolute madness, we restart this game 9 versus 9. He kicked his foot. He's kicked his foot. He's kicked his foot. Yeah, no, he kicked his foot. Nah, mate, you've even heard it, the kick. A ball don't sound like that. 
I'm in the vault. I'm in the vault. From that resulting free kick, it goes in as 1-0 NLR strikes it and the bottom corner keeper couldn't get to it. 1-0 in this cup game. Obstruction, 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 not the shoulder, obstruction. Jumped into him. Over there. Yes. Two of you, glasses and captain. Yes, mate. Look where I'm standing. Another controversial offside call, so I'm in a great position. Uh, just before his kick, this is the guy who's offside. Is he leaning offside already? And then this is just after he's kicked. Uh, you can kind of see all the reds on the line, and he's behind that defender. So is he offside? Uh, I definitely thought it was. And then as soon as he goes to make contact with it, you see me going to blow my whistle straight away because I was confident. Uh, great finish, but offside. So goal disallowed. It remains 1-0. No way! Mate, they've gone shoulder to shoulder and then he's just fallen. No way! There wasn't in the back, no chance. Another controversial goal, uh, not even the six complained about this. Look, they go together and then the striker's just stronger, uh, gets the ball, uh, he's through down the side and then he passes it across to his teammate for a tap-in. Sorry about the sun, uh, it was really affecting the camera this game. But it's 2-0 to NLR in this crazy cut match. Uh, let me know if you would have given a free kick. And this is a couple of seconds before half-time. Uh, the cameraman decided to end the half early. Don't know why, but half-time, NLR 2-0 up. And that's the half-time whistle. NLR go into the half-time 2-0 up. Um, let's just get straight into it. That incident was just absolutely crazy. Uh, out of nothing. So before that, both teams just wanted to play football. There was probably one or two fouls max. Uh, nothing bad said to each other. And then all of a sudden, that just happens. Um, the softest foul ever gave the free kick to Highgate Albion's for a pull on the arm. And then it just explodes into a fight. Four red cards, punches being thrown everywhere. Uh, it was just crazy. Uh, shout out to the people that tried to stop it. And also to the Highgate Albion threes keeper, who's the only one who apologised for all of that madness. Um, but yeah, it was crazy. Let me know what you thought about that incident and also the offside goal that Highgate Albion 3 scored. Let me know, do you think it was offside or not? Um, difficult angle, obviously, because I'm at the halfway line. So uh, yeah, let me know from the still images what you thought. Uh, other than that crazy incident, it's been a good half, been a good game of football. But yeah, nine versus nine men. I've ref three times on this pitch and I've issued eight red cards. So uh, I don't like this pitch anymore. I don't like this Astro pitch. Send me back to grass. But yeah, we're in for a crazy second half. Let me know how you think I did. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the second half. We'll see you at full time. No, no, he's dropped it. The manager or coach are going crazy, wanting a penalty. So uh, let's take a look at this one. Uh, we'll zoom in a bit here. Uh, who's got their arms on who there? And he goes down. That looks soft. If I've given that, that would look like a really soft penalty. Uh, let's take a look one more time at this. Uh, so here we go again. Um, so the defender gets to the right of him. Let's see here who's got their arms on who there um and then he goes down again i'm not even being biased i'm completely honest on this channel i know when i've got things wrong i just don't see enough for a penalty let me know your thoughts on that Two 
2-1, Highgate get one back, a shots are offside, uh, this guy definitely was on the side, he uh, made the run from behind and then plays it across, nice little finish there, 2-1, Highgate back in it. Another controversial offside call, so let's take a look now. Um, so he's definitely offside here. This is not the issue. The issue is where is the left back? And um, no idea. He's not in camera, so I can't comment on this. Uh, that's the most annoying thing. This is the only one I wanted. There he is now. Was he keeping him onside? I wish, I wish this was in camera. Um, and then he goes on to finish it, but the keeper's not really doing anything. Uh, two players complained. The manager, oh sorry, the coach said stop cheating, hence why he got the red card. It's such an awful thing to say. I have no reason to cheat. I don't even know NLR. I know three people from the Highgate team. Two I've played football with and one is the committee member of the Barnet Sunday League and runs the referees and sorts out the fixtures. So uh, if anything, I should be favouring more the Highgate side. But yeah, let me know what you think. Uh, it's not clear, which is frustrating. Another controversial onside offside call. Is he offside? Is he onside? Has he made a good run anyway? Uh, it's not been given as offside. So uh, he's played through there. Uh, number 14 is that. Has a strike. The keeper does well there. No idea what's going on. He couldn't get the ball. And then the two strikes hit. The right back kind of just sticks the leg out. Goes up in here and into the own goal. It's 2 2 in this crazy game. Another controversial offside call, a 3-2 to NLR, this is where he kicks the ball I believe, is he offside, um, we can see the high gate going in back as well. It's not as clear as he thought it was, um, and then he just stops, and then it's a great finish there. Um, keeper had no chance, and the keeper's had a great game as well. Let me know what you think on that one. 3 2 to NLR. Another controversial offside call. Uh, the person on the far left. This is about a second after the ball has been passed. And you can see they were quite even there all the way on the left. So uh, if it's a second after, I think this one was definitely onside. Uh, I'm pretty sure of it. 3-3. Three, three, we might get penalties. Go on, Landy. Bring it down. Bring it down. Men coming in. Yes! Yes! Nothing controversial about this goal and what could possibly be the winner. Uh, switches play quite a good ball, uh, beats the right back, goes in the box, cuts it across. First time finish. Keeper nearly gets it. You know what? The keeper's had a good game. He's made some great saves, but just couldn't get to that one. And have NLR snatched it in the last minute of this quarterfinal match. Last booking of the game, uh, he was in quite a bit of pain there. He nicks the ball there and the player just kicks him. Uh, he was too slow to the ball. And yeah, yellow card uh, showed there to the player. And that's the full-time whistle. NLR with the cup upset. They win 4-3 with a late winner. 90th minute, I believe. Uh, crazy second half.
Nothing like the first half with the fight, but a lot of controversial offside calls. It's what happens when you want the referee to call the line. They're never in line, so um, I did ask the managers. NLR didn't mind. The Highgate Albion 3's coach that I set off didn't want club linesmen. So he just said for me to call the lines and he'd rather I make the bad calls. But uh, yeah, so he told me to stop cheating. I don't know why I would cheat. That's why I sent him off. But yeah, crazy uh, second half with all those calls. Let me know how you think I did. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed this one. This game was quite difficult to referee in the second half. Uh, I was trying to work extra hard to get in line with the back four of NLR just because Highgate Albion 3s were attacking the most. And so I was trying to put in that extra bit of running just to get in line and call the offside properly, which is difficult because you're trying to ref, trying to do the line. And then uh, NLR had like a counter-attack and they had a controversial offside goal which I wasn't in line for, but it looked super close. So, yeah, they go through to the semi-finals. Uh, let me know down in the comment section below how you think I did. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next week for another episode of Rest World.